Chapter 1, Understanding Sustainability. Sustainability is a concept that encompasses the ability to maintain ecological balance while meeting the needs of the present generation without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. It emphasizes the importance of finding a harmonious relationship between humans and the environment. At its core, sustainability revolves around the idea of achieving a balance between social, economic, and environmental factors. It recognizes that our actions have consequences and that it is essential to take responsibility for our impact on the planet. By adopting sustainable practices, we can ensure that we leave a positive legacy for the generations to come. The concept of ecological balance is a fundamental aspect of sustainability. It refers to the equilibrium and interdependence between living organisms and their environment. This balance enables the functioning and preservation of ecosystems, ensuring their long-term survival. Understanding and maintaining ecological balance is crucial for sustaining the diverse flora and fauna on our planet. Another key aspect of sustainability is the consideration of our needs. Meeting our needs is essential for human well-being and development. However, it is crucial to do so in a way that does not harm the environment or compromise the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. This requires responsible resource management, efficient use of energy, and the development of sustainable technologies. Thinking about future generations is an integral part of the sustainability paradigm. It urges us to think beyond our immediate needs and consider the long-term consequences of our actions. By embracing sustainable practices today, we can create a better future for the next generations, ensuring that they have access to clean air, water, and a thriving natural environment. Sustainability is not just an individual endeavor. It requires collective action. Governments, businesses, and communities all play a vital role in advancing sustainability. By working together and implementing sustainable policies and practices, we can create a future that is both environmentally and economically stable. In conclusion, sustainability is about finding a balance between meeting our needs and maintaining ecological equilibrium. It is about considering the needs of both the present and future generations. By promoting sustainability, we can ensure that our actions today do not compromise the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. Through responsible resource management, conscious consumer choices, and collaborative efforts, we can strive for a future that is sustainable, equitable, and prosperous for all. Question, what is the concept of sustainability? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2, The Role of Brands in Promoting Sustainability Julia had always been passionate about sustainability and environmental conservation. Ever since she was a child, she had watched documentaries and read books about the impact of human activities on the planet. Now, as an adult, she decided to take action and explore how brands could play a role in promoting a greener environment. In her research, Julia discovered that many brands were waking up to the importance of eco-friendly practices. They recognized that consumers were becoming more conscious of their environmental impact and were actively seeking sustainable products. This realization presented an opportunity for brands to not only meet the growing demand, but also contribute to a healthier planet. With this in mind, Julia interviewed several brands known for their commitment to sustainability. She wanted to understand how they were incorporating eco-friendly practices into their operations and what motivated them to do so. One brand that stood out was a clothing company called Greenware. They took pride in using ethically sourced materials and reducing their carbon footprint in every aspect of their production. The founder emphasized their commitment to creating stylish and sustainable clothing options for consumers who wanted to make a positive impact. Another brand, Tara Brew, 
caught Julia's attention. They were a coffee company dedicated to promoting sustainable farming practices and fair trade. They sourced their beans from local farmers who used organic methods, ensuring that their products not only tasted great but were also produced in an environmentally responsible way. As Julia delved deeper into her research, she realized that these brands were not just focused on profit, they genuinely cared about making a difference. They understood the power of their influence and used it to raise awareness about environmental issues. They believed that by promoting sustainability, they could inspire other businesses and individuals to follow their lead. Julia also discovered that many brands were actively partnering with environmental organizations to fund projects and initiatives that aimed to protect the planet. For example, a skincare company called Pure Nature had established a foundation dedicated solely to environmental conservation. Through their partnership with the various NGOs, they were able to contribute to reforestation efforts and support clean water projects in impoverished communities. Inspired by the stories she encountered, Julia began to see the potential for brands to be catalysts for change. She recognized that consumers had the power to shape the market by choosing products and supporting brands that aligned with their values. By opting for sustainable options, they could send a clear message to brands that environmental consciousness mattered. Julia couldn't help but feel hopeful for the future. With more brands embracing eco-friendly practices and offering sustainable alternatives, she believed that a greener and more sustainable world was within reach. She was inspired to continue her research and spread the word about the positive impact brands could have on the environment. As she concluded her research for this chapter, Julia realized that promoting sustainability went beyond individual choices it required a collective effort. Brands played a crucial role in this effort by innovating and providing sustainable products. By choosing to support these brands and demanding more sustainable options, consumers could contribute to a greener and healthier planet for generations to come. Question: How can brands contribute to promoting a greener environment? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 3 Building Sustainable Brand Strategies Building Sustainable Brand Strategies In Chapter 3 of her research, Julia delved deeper into the topic of building sustainable brand strategies. She wanted to understand how brands could incorporate environmental goals into their core values and engage stakeholders in sustainable initiatives. Julia discovered that sustainable brand strategies involved careful planning and implementation to ensure that companies effectively achieve their environmental goals. It required a comprehensive understanding of the impact their operations had on the planet and a commitment to minimizing their ecological footprint. One brand that Julia interviewed, Biotech Solutions, epitomized the essence of sustainable brand strategies. They specialized in developing eco-friendly cleaning products and were deeply committed to promoting a circular economy. Their core values of environmental responsibility guided every aspect of their business, from sourcing ingredients to manufacturing and packaging. By engaging stakeholders, Biotech Solutions ensured that their sustainable initiatives extended beyond their immediate operations. They actively collaborated with customers, suppliers, and employees to raise awareness about environmental issues and encourage responsible behaviors. Their goal was not only to provide sustainable products, but also to inspire a broader movement towards a greener future. As Julia interviewed other brands, she noted that engaging stakeholders was a consistent theme in their sustainable brand strategies. Companies like Greener Tech, a technology firm, emphasized the importance of involving their customers in the journey towards sustainability. They encouraged feedback and suggestions, empowering customers to actively participate in shaping the direction of their sustainable initiatives. Julia also found that brands were increasingly leveraging technology and innovation 
to achieve their environmental goals. By adopting smart manufacturing processes and investing in renewable energy sources, these companies were able to reduce their carbon footprint significantly. They embraced sustainable packaging solutions, employing recyclable materials and reducing waste throughout the supply chain. An essential aspect of sustainable brand strategies was transparency. Brands like Green Grocery recognized the significance of providing customers with clear and accurate information about their product's environmental impact. They believed that transparency was key in building trust and fostering long-term relationships with socially conscious consumers. Throughout her research, Julia noticed a common thread among these brands, a genuine commitment to making a positive impact on the planet. They understood that sustainability was not just a marketing buzzword, but a responsibility they owed to future generations. By incorporating sustainable practices into their business operations, they aimed to leave a positive environmental legacy. Julia couldn't help but be inspired by these stories of companies striving to make a difference. Their efforts to build sustainable brand strategies showed that businesses had a unique ability to shape the future of our planet. By creating environmentally conscious products and engaging stakeholders in their initiatives, these brands were leading the way towards a more sustainable world. As Julia concluded her research for this chapter, she felt a renewed sense of optimism. Sustainable brand strategies were not just theoretical concepts, they were real-world approaches being implemented by forward-thinking companies. With continued support from consumers, these brands had the potential to drive significant change and accelerate the transition towards a truly sustainable global economy. Julia was determined to share her findings and raise awareness about the power of sustainable brand strategies. She wanted to inspire others to support these brands and demand even greater commitment to sustainability. By doing so, she believed that, that together, businesses and consumers could create a future where environmental responsibility was at the forefront of every decision, paving the way for a healthier and more sustainable planet. Question, what are the key elements to consider when building sustainable brand strategies? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 4, Consumer Perception of Sustainable Brands Consumer Perception of Sustainable Brands In Chapter 4 of her research, Julia delved into the important topic of consumer perception of sustainable brands. She wanted to understand how consumers perceived and interacted with brands that prioritized sustainability, and how these perceptions influenced their purchasing decisions. Julia discovered that consumer perception played a crucial role in the success of sustainable brands. Consumers were increasingly aware of and concerned about environmental issues, and they sought out brands that shared their values of responsibility and environmental consciousness. One key aspect of consumer perception was trustworthiness. Julia found that consumers were more likely to trust and engage with brands that demonstrated a genuine commitment to sustainability. Brands like EcoWare, a clothing company using ethically sourced and recycled materials, had successfully cultivated a reputation for being responsible and trustworthy. Their efforts to promote sustainable fashion resonated with consumers who valued eco-consciousness and ethical production practices. Positive brand associations were another critical factor in consumer perception of sustainable brands. Companies that actively showcased their sustainability initiatives and communicated their environmental goals effectively were more likely to create positive brand associations in the minds of consumers. Brands like Green Living, with their transparent reporting on carbon emissions reductions and renewable energy usage, were able to build strong brand loyalty among environmentally conscious consumers. Julia also found that consumer perception of sustainable brands was influenced by the overall brand experience. Brands that provided exceptional customer service and went above and beyond to meet consumer expectations garnered higher levels of satisfaction and loyalty. 
For instance, Sustainable Solutions, a cleaning product brand, not only offered eco-friendly products, but also provided informative content on their website and engaged with customers through social media platforms, inspiring a sense of community and shared values. Further, Julia discovered that storytelling played a significant role in shaping consumer perceptions of sustainable brands. Brands that effectively communicated their sustainability journey and the positive impact they were making on the environment were able to engage consumers on a deeper emotional level. By sharing stories of their commitment to reducing waste or reforestation efforts, Brands like Green Earth were able to create an emotional connection with consumers, making them feel like they were actively contributing to a greener future when purchasing from these brands. Additionally, in her research, Julia uncovered the importance of price and value perception when it came to sustainable brands. Consumers were willing to pay a premium for products from environmentally conscious brands if they perceived them to offer superior quality and align with their values. Sustainable brands that effectively communicated the value and benefits of their products or services, such as energy-efficient appliances from EcoSmart, were able to justify higher price points while still maintaining consumer interest and loyalty. Julia's research highlighted the significance of consumer perception in shaping the success of sustainable brands. Consumers were actively seeking out brands that aligned with their values and demonstrated a commitment to environmental responsibility. By building trust, creating positive brand associations, and providing a seamless brand experience, sustainable brands could capture the attention and loyalty of environmentally conscious consumers. As Julia concluded this chapter, she reflected on the power of consumer perception and its ability to drive change. By supporting sustainable brands and choosing environmentally conscious products, consumers had the ability to influence the market and encourage more companies to adopt sustainable practices. Julia hoped that her research would inspire both brands and consumers to come together in creating a future where sustainability, was at the core of every decision, paving the way for a healthier planet for generations to come. Question, how do consumers perceive sustainable brands? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 5, Challenges and Opportunities in Trademarking Sustainability. In Chapter 5, Julia explored the challenges and opportunities associated with trademarking sustainability. She recognized that as the demand for sustainable products and services grew, so did the need for brands to differentiate themselves in the marketplace. Trademarking sustainability presented both obstacles and possibilities for brands striving to meet the expectations of environmentally conscious consumers. One of the challenges Julia uncovered was the prevalence of greenwashing. Greenwashing referred to brands that falsely claimed to be environmentally friendly or sustainable in order to attract customers. This deceptive practice undermined consumer trust and made it difficult for genuinely sustainable brands to stand out in a crowded market. Julia emphasized the importance of transparency in combating greenwashing and building consumer confidence. Brands that were able to clearly communicate their environmentally responsible practices and back them up with evidence or certifications had a higher chance of gaining the trust of their target audience. However, despite the challenges, trademarking sustainability also presented significant opportunities for brands. When done effectively, it allowed them to establish a competitive edge and attract environmentally conscious consumers. Julia highlighted the importance of differentiation in this process. Brands that could clearly articulate their unique approach to sustainability were able to stand out from the competition. For example, Organic Delights, a food company, successfully trademarked their farm-to-table guarantee, which assured consumers of the origin and ecological integrity of their products. This differentiation helped them capture the attention of eco-conscious consumers seeking reassurance about the transparency of their food sources. Moreover, 
trademarking sustainability also presented opportunities for brands to contribute to a greener economy. Julia believed that the trademarking process could encourage innovation and incentivize companies to adopt more sustainable practices. By protecting their sustainable branding strategies, brands were motivated to invest in research and development, creating new and improved environmentally friendly products and services. This not only generated economic growth, but also steered the market towards a greener future. However, Julia was mindful of the potential pitfalls that could arise during the trademarking process. Overzealous trademarking could lead to the monopolization of sustainable terms and concepts, hindering the overall progress towards a more sustainable economy. Julia advocated for a balanced approach that encouraged innovation while maintaining accessibility and inclusivity within the sustainability space. In her research, Julia discovered that trademarking sustainability necessitated a comprehensive understanding of intellectual property laws and regulations. Brands needed to ensure that their sustainability claims were unique, protectable, and in compliance with relevant legal requirements. This was particularly crucial in industries where sustainability claims were widely used, such as fashion or personal care. Brands like EcoChic, which successfully trademarked their zero-waste fashion concept, had secured a distinctive position in the market, safeguarding their sustainability-driven differentiation. As Julia concluded this chapter, she acknowledged that trademarking sustainability was a complex yet integral aspect of building a sustainable brand. It posed various challenges, such as combating greenwashing and preserving transparency. However, it also presented opportunities for brands to differentiate themselves, contribute to a greener economy, and build lasting relationships with environmentally conscious consumers. By navigating the trademarking process carefully and responsibly, Brands could not only protect their sustainability efforts, but also drive positive change in the marketplace. Julia hoped that her research would serve as a guide for brands looking to trademark sustainability and promote a more sustainable future for all. Question, what are the main challenges and opportunities brands face in trademarking sustainability? Check the video.